Chuck Mortler here. Welcome back to our Darkest Dungeon Let's Play. Last episode, we cleared out a long ruins dungeon. Um, it was a very, very good mission, actually. We got a lot of money out of it. Um, actually, actually got more money out of it than we had before I started preparations for the mission itself. Um, so yeah, that, that's very good. We got a secret room in there, we got to fight the collector, which didn't drop the uh, crystal, the, the gem thingy. Uh, but he got us a head that I can sell, actually should do it ASAP, probably. The Baristan's head, the worst one. Uh, let's sell it ASAP. Uh, and yeah, I got people to level 6, which were... Lucas, Tyler, and Yurtsp. Uh Pretty likely that Lucas is not gonna go any, on any other missions, unless we go to the ruins, which we probably will. Uh, we'll see. Uh, aside from that, we got very good quirks for finishing the mission, um, which actually make the difference in uh, who am I gonna be bringing to the courtyard when it comes to the Vestal choice. Uh, but yeah, today is the day that we're going back into the courtyard. Um, as I've mentioned previously, uh, we're gonna be using the same squad composition as last time. Um, it's not the same people as last time. Obviously, um, Mr. Gaming Daddy died trying to help us out there, so we're taking OK then lol this time. He has Quick Draw, which is really good. Steady is gonna help quite a bit as well. Thick Blooded, I don't think it's gonna matter at all. Hippocratic, maybe a little bit. Precise Striker, I mean, Hound's Rush is uh, ranged. We're also going to be using Hound's Harry at the boss fight, probably. Both are ranged, so it doesn't do anything for us. But decent, uh, decent dog overall. We're bringing Coastal Defense, and the reason we're bringing Coastal Defense over... I think it was Nameless Hero. Yeah, Nameless Hero has Hippocratic, which is great to help us healing, but there, is, there isn't anything else that he has. That helps us out really. On the other hand, when we look at the coastal defense, we got we had quick draw and warrior of light and resilient, which are pretty decent, especially for a very long mission like this one we're going on, which we want to clear out in one go. We just got luminous as well. Now I do understand that it might get overwritten, and it's gonna suck if it does. I would love the infomania to get overwritten. Uh, but I want to go there, I don't want to spend time locking it in, and it's gonna be so expensive to lock it in anyways. Um, but yeah, considering we got the Luminous, just having the extra two, two base speed and quick draw as well. Speed 9 right now, actually doesn't take quick draw into account, so we're actually starting each fight with speed 13, which I think is gonna help out quite a bit. Warrior of Light is also pretty decent. Uh, we're taking Shion X. Um, I think I was debating between him and a hardy W, uh, who has deadly and Hi oh, Hippocratic doesn't actually do anything. He only has deadly. Do I have any other bounty hunters? Yeah, I have that dude myth, but that dude myth has even less going for him. Like, I mean, Clotter is nice, but he also has Fanatophobia, which gotta go. And on the other hand, a hardy W. Um, I sent him to, stre to get stress healed and he's stuck in there. So, yeah, it's just gonna be stuck in there. Shion X, Asphalomania, really good overall. Slugger, really nice as well. It's gonna be our stunner, so it's not gonna be making full use of it because it's gonna be using Flashbang. Uh, but he also has Spiritual, which is nice. Clutch Hatter can be helpful. Cove Tactician, doesn't matter what for a thing. And Happy Finn, Flagellant. Uh, he has Steady, nothing else, essentially. I mean, Second Wind is, I guess, useful, maybe. Hopefully, hopefully we'll actually make use of it, because, you know, last time it didn't go as well of Flagellant getting actually hit. Uh, but yeah, Happy Finn is going in, Steady is gonna help quite a bit. So yeah, this is the team comp. I do understand that there are better team comps against the boss fight itself, but for the overall dungeon and for the idea of trying to do it in one go, which... I'm kind of on the verge of even attempting that. I will take into serious consideration stopping the dungeon, stopping doing the dungeon just before the boss fight and going in there with proper team comp. Uh, depends, like our weak count allows us to even think about it, so 
I might make that switch at the very end. Because things like Plague Doctor would do much better against the boss fight itself. That's not... That's not... That's not... Oh, that's neither here nor there. Mm -mm, if I can speak today. Uh, so yeah, we, we'll get to think about it once we're at the very end of the dungeon. So it's um, quite a ways away. Uh, but yeah, let's prepare for, for the dungeon, shall we? Let's deal with the stress. Which doesn't exist. We have some diseases though. Uh, doing this dungeon not only is gonna um, remove the curses, it's also gonna give us a nice cash influx. Considering we're not gonna be spending anything on upgrading our heroes because they're already upgraded. I, I think uh, there is gonna be some upgrades that I'm gonna be going with because I probably don't have all the skills I want. Uh, but yeah. We're basically there as it is. Uh, before I remove bad quirks, let me actually prepare the team. Uh, so I'm 100% sure everything is ready. You are ready, Happy Finn. Don't want these. Shawan X, you are ready as well. Coastal defense, you're ready. Okay, then, lol. You're actually not ready. Now, hear me out. I understand Hound's Harry is not the best of skills there is. And it's uh, way, way, way better against things like flesh. That, that's where the, the skill really shines. Uh, but, and I'm not going to be using this for the dungeon. I'm only taking this for the boss fight. Now, the boss fight has multiple enemies in it. And it has a gimmick that it takes the dots off of the other enemies onto itself once it eats them or whatever so i want to stack as much as much bleed as possible with okay then lol in there as well and i will probably don't won't need cry havoc for the fight uh so yeah that's the idea that's why the plague doctor is also decent in there but uh, that's neither here nor there uh so our general um skill is gonna be hounds rush cry havoc guard and lick wound but for the boss fight i gotta take the hounds harry uh, at least I want to give it a shot. Also with Happy Fen, also stacking bleeds could be decent. I know uh, some of them have very high bleed resist as it is, but some of them are not that high, so I, I hope how Seri actually gonna uh, prove worthwhile. Alright, that's done. Equipment is all done. Okay, I can actually do work removal for once. Which would be decent. I mean, these are annoying, but they do don't do anything. Actually, and quiet mind is probably the worst, but uh, automatophobia gotta go. ASAP. Deadly would be nice to lock in, but I don't have that kind of cash right now. I mean, I do, but I don't, you know. Anatophobia is also pretty bad. Let's get rid of that immediately. Don't have anything to lock in. All right, that's done. Come on. Any good trinkets? Nope. Let's do the camping skills. So I still remember about these. Uh, we get to take four, right? I mean, I could just take the Lashes Kiss just to have it. I could even upgrade this thing. Eh, it's already cheap. Uh, I won't need scouting. So what I'm going to be using is... I don't even need plant takedown. I'm pretty sure the enemy size one. This is gonna be this is how we do it. Even if, if we even get any camping in there, so I'm gonna take the encourage. You Sanctuary isn't actually bad if I get uh death starred. Alright, that looks decent. Seems good enough. Also gotta get to stack some more money. I'm gonna sell this. Oh yeah, we got the hand handkerchief. Oh man, that's another 15k out of that mission. So good. Selling both of them ASAP. 50k? Man, that's a lot of cash we got. <laughs> Cries and over 100k he had. Uh, okay. Let's get the trinkets and let's get going in there, shall we? Focus ring. We're mostly... Um, uh, what's it called? Cursed. Which is basically bound to happen in there anyways. 
Uh, but yeah, we'll, we'll be dealing with it by completing this mission, obviously. Using the Shionex as the stunner. Not that much damage because of that, but that's okay. You need the bleed. I sold the other trinket for the bleed chance. We're gonna take this one. You, you need healing. Now I don't need scouting. So I get to choose. I'm space speed 9 right now with the disease. So it's 8 without it. It's not a bad speed amount right now. So it's between Junia's head, which gives us a lot of stress, or Swift Cloak. It's honestly only between these two. I think I'm gonna go with Swift Cloak actually, just to have all the speed in the world. Don't have the 4 focus ring, which we sold way, way, way back. It wouldn't even be that terrible of an option to bring it, bring it on the Vestal here, considering how speedy she is already. Um, that's okay. Now, the more I look at this item, the more this looks like a dog item. Like, it really does. Do I switch it up this time? Do I go for the dog stunning? Like this is almost as good as the the casual weight. And it well it gives speed, so it's better in that that manner. It just gives lower stun chance. Man, I don't know. I mean I need the dog to stress heal. That's why he's in position four. Technically, I can switch these around, right? I can literally switch these. I can have them like this and do this for now. Uh, like this. That gives me a lot of more, a lot more damage, I think. Or is backline access? Uh, the bounty hunter has way better damage range. The base is higher and the uh, end and roll is way higher as well. And a fire crit chance. And we're faster. Wait, why am I this fast? I really like craving AUR. Hmm. <laughs> we're gonna have 15 speed with dog this way, so we're guaranteed to stun something. <laughs> Ah, uh, you know, this is not terrible, actually. The dog can also mark for me. In this, in this composition. I would be stunning instead of having Cry Havoc. My, my skill bar would be so weird on the dog. It would be Hound's Rush, Blackjack, Cry Havoc, and Whistle. Well, no, not Cry Havoc. I would have one of these. I don't have the stress healing capabilities this way. But I feel like my damage is so much higher. Crit chance is higher, I don't get the bleed. Okay, I can really switch them around this way. I think I would need to use the dog for the fights against Crocs. Just to have the backline access. Alright, I think I'm gonna give it a go this way. Just to switch it up a little bit. I think this can work a little bit better, but that means I also need to teach the dog. This. This. I do want target whistle. Because I'm not necessarily gonna be stunning all the time. And it's really good for the Bounty Hunter. It's more expensive this way, but I think it can work out. Now, let's do the skills. Yours don't necessarily look fine. I do want to stick to Reclaim at least. Now, it's between Exanguinate and Redeem. I think I can start with Exanguinate and then decide. Redeem is obviously a safer option. Alright, Blackjack. Uh, target Whistle. Uh, 
Okay, so at position three, so it's fine. Target whistle and one of these. I'm gonna go with lick wounds because I have Hippocratic. Guard is the safer option. All right, let's give it a go, shall we? Now this mission is massive. It's absolutely ginormous. We need at least three shovels. I mean, I'm gonna take all of them, obviously. I'm gonna take, I oh, don't know, 12 torches. I'm pretty sure I didn't use all of them last time. Take 12 blood. I don't think I need 12 blood. I'm gonna take eight. The idea is that I'll likely get some more, some back from the fights. Now, what are the courtyard curios? It's blood, blood. We don't want to spend the blood on those. We want the tor. I, I might as well take 16 torches because why not? Uh, we want shovels. We have those. We want bandages. Seems that we want herbs as well. And holy waters. All the food. Probably gonna be tossing some away, but it's okay. This is not a mission where we're gonna be getting money out of the dungeon itself. It's gonna be the mission success that gives us the gold. Essentially. We don't need keys for anything. Laudunum, I don't know if it's gonna be... I'm, I'm actually contemplating Aegis a little bit. A little tiny bit. Torches should be good enough. Bandages is fine as it is. I could take some anti venom for the stress relief with wine card if I don't use the camp. Herbs, torches, shovels, holy water. I think this is fine as it is. Okay. This is way more food than we, than we need, I think. we ca You can't get food pings in here. I think they're way redder though, which is cool. Alright, just one inventory slot to actually gather something. And I mean, the dog treats are not gonna survive till the boss fight. There's just no way. And even if they did, I would forget to use them on the boss fight. You, you know me. All right, uh, let's go in, shall we? Wish me luck. It's gonna be a long one. The feasting and revelry would last for weeks at a time. Great stone tables were set with such an abundance of rare delicacies that we would stuff ourselves until the exotic became mundane. When the lavish spread began to spoil, a ravenous gourmand gleefully proposed that we sample from the fetid pile of composting refuse. The notion was dismissed as decidedly unhealthy. But days later, he was found cackling madly atop a heap of rancid comestibles, <laughs> licking his fingers in delight. Jeez. Uh, all right. As always, with the courtyard missions, I have the map open. I'm gonna let you see it at some point in this recording as well. Um, the only thing I counted for the map itself is how many obstacles there are that are mandatory for me to go through. The mandatory ones, I, I counted two. We're gonna be going through three, I think, though. Uh, because it's just closer that way to the end of the mission. And it's less fights that way, I think. I didn't ca count it all up, but it's fine. All right, let us get started, shall we? Oh, you're you're all craving. Oh shit! I need. I should have taken my blood, huh? I regret everything already. Good start, boys. Good start. Uh, that's loot. Sure, why not? Gold. That's never gonna see. <laughs> Heirlooms. Yeah. No. That's a funny game. Nice trying giving us those. I keep forgetting I don't need to use the torchlight. Uh, let's heal. We're a bit lower. Because of the curse, I think. 
Uh, I wouldn't have done that, dude. That doesn't quite help. They're not actually bloodsuckers, so we don't get our benefits of the speed and damage. Wow, they have so much dodge. Maybe I should have hit the other one. Maybe. It's not gonna be that big of a deal. It's only the base ones and no... Uh, no blight ones, so... It's all good. It's dead. Do the bleed. Maybe get to the stress of bounty hunter. Nope. Yeah, well, I, I doubt that these sapphires are gonna make it through. I'm gonna try keeping them and stacking them, but it's unlikely that's gonna happen, so don't count on that. Gotta kill the manservant ASAP. This guy's also about to. 11 speed, shit. And highest dodge, too. And my accuracy is insane, isn't it? on this guy first. This girl buffs them all. I think the manservant and the squire are the more deadly ones though. Okay, it's dead now. Perfect. Are you more stunnable? So let's try stunning you first. Then go through. It's fine. Now... I'm gonna kill a squire first, I think. It's actually gonna be easier to kill courtesan because I can use the Bounty Hunter to be getting the better bleeds though. Alright, fine, let's go with the oh. Okay. That is the reason I actually want Bounty Hunter as a DPS instead of the dog. Okay, that increases damage to me. What does it do? Oh shit! Oh calm down! No 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 no! Alright, that wasn't half bad. The stress is obviously bad, but slowly. Alright, it all works out in the end. Hit this girl, hit this guy. I'm gonna bet on... Oh, 95%? Are you shitting me already? Oh, come on, kill. Nice. Ooh, that's one health, isn't it? No, that's more than one. Okay. Alright, got him good. All right, put those no down. Order. Another, uh, another one of these, huh? Well, goodbye. Good. Uh, there's no way gold makes it through this dungeon. It's just no way. Okay, we're going up. There's nothing down really. To the right is the gate. We need the key. Now I should maybe move around and de-stress next fight. That's fine. Flower pot, what do you do? I think it's shovels. It is shovels. Is it even worth it? I should take it on the way back, honestly. Unless it's the stress, I should be taking these on the way back because we're gonna be going coming back this way too. Just less stress that way, I think. Less spite. Mostly. Okay, that's de-stressing. Oh, there's no fight in here. That's that's interesting. How much de-stressing is this? I think it's 30. Yeah, I'll take it now because of the uh, bounty hunter being stressed already. This means I don't need to move around for the dog to de-stress the party yet. I can stick to the higher DPS. A uh, comp. Now there's a trap here, which I didn't see because... Uh... Wow! Fight? This is because I stepped in it. Interesting. That's a new one for me. Alright. Supplicants are not stunnable as always. Gotta deal with those. ASAP. This is the first one I'm gonna try killing. Uh, I mean, that's okay. You know what? Let's deal with Psychophant so it's dead. Annoying. I have anti-venom, which I'm gonna use. Oh well, give me the healing. Thank you very much. Now, this should be the kill with the bleeds, and it is. 
I'm gonna use the anti-venom. The, the blight is high enough to warrant it, I think. Nice crit shown. Come on, outspeed Vestal. Come on. You're very speedy. You can do it. Speed, yeah, you speed 11. Yeah, you are very speedy, Coastal. <laughs> you really, really are. Okay, got the blood, which I'm gonna be dropping something for it. Uh, which is what? I suppose emeralds? Fine. I think I got to get this blood if I'm going for the full clear again. In one go. I mean, the mission in its own right gives you a lot of gold. It's 25k if you finish it. I think what I'm gonna do is go through this fight. It is, this room has a fight. And then uh, switch the party order. I mean, I'm gonna use these to get the gems only, Wealth basically. Passing all the gold. To the brave and the alike. Let's shovel. I mean, again, I probably should be taking these on the way back. Probably. Double Mount Serpent. They gotta go immediately. I'm not 100% sure if regular man Servants can spawn Psychophants. But I know for sure but that the ones of Invitation can. And that's, uh, that's not the world I want to be living in, you know? That's fine, I was going for you anyways. Touch this bleed. Good. Good. Alright, I was about to say that the dog is the only one without the curse. Come on, give it to me. No? Really? That's annoying, it's a lot of stress, isn't it? But the good thing is that we don't have a single stress item on the Vestal. That's actually very, very significant. Let's try getting rid of the guard. Nice, got it. Now, I'm gonna... I'm gonna try this. Unfortunate. Because that would mean I don't need to hit him anymore. I wanna hit the... Uh, no, what is it called? Cortisan. Okay, the bleeds finishes her off right now. I don't want to give her an action though. Let's kill her. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. You really want to get the dog in the line, I suppose. I need to hit the man servant once more. Or I'm gonna heal here. Nice crit for the stress heal. Nice crit. Now, I haven't moved yet. Let's kill you. Wow. Okay. Con continue with these, please, so I can stress heal. Thank you. Now, this is guaranteed hit, basically. I, I wasn't looking for the stun, I was looking only for the damage to finish it off with the bleed. I wanna use this one in hopes that it de stresses me, then get the bleed on myself, which is nice. Another de-stress, really good. Are you serious? Are you really telling me I have to drop all of this gold? It pains me. It really does. Oh god. Do I have to? I don't want to. <laughs> Is it greedy to want the skull right now? I mean, I think I could just drop the shovel. Let's... no... Maybe the stack of food. Let's drop one stack of food. This pains me. Alright, now... I'm gonna switch your positions. You're gonna be de-stressing right now. So I need to swap their items somehow. Which I'm not quite sure how I'm supposed to do it yet. Hounds rush, cry havoc, lick wounds, and uh, this way. Oh, you already had the skills. How do I switch the items? I need to drop something. I think it could be the shovels, honestly. 
you, why don't you go there? I mean, I only need three of them. So... If I want to be doing this, I, I have to be doing it like that. Okay. The dog is still the DPS. Don't don't worry about that. It's just that I want to de-stress uh, the Vestal at least. At least a little bit. Since the stress is uh, kind of amassing here. Right. At least one fight out of us. Not sure if this one is a fight. Right, man servant gotta go again. It's more likely to st actually stun the second hand here. Nice. Oh, that's the stress. Might have been very greedy to do it on turn one actually. Oh, let's try killing this guy. What a roll. What a roll that was. Let's get the bleed on it. Uh, it's dead now, so that's perfect. Yeah, that's the target we want getting hit. Uh, I blight, but I might actually not be... Oh, no, I will. If it gets another one... It did. Oh. Well. That was cool. Psychophant is going I'm gonna heal. I'm only gonna go for the AoE heal, but I will heal still because if the Psychophant hits me here, that could be very. Oh, wait, 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 here's the stunner. Wait, what am I doing? Okay, I'm removing this. Kill you. Nice. Another one bites the dust. Let's keep de stressing. Might actually be able to switch back the positions after this fight. I think I'll do it. The stress is going low fairly nice. I'm gonna go for a direct heal here. Since we... Crap! I'm the stunner! Oh, they're not stunnable. Never mind. Never mind. Take that back. Nice high roll. It's gonna die in two turns now. Good. Oh yeah, the, I'm, I'm gonna keep healing the flagellant there because um, uh, there's like no way I'm gonna get use exsanguinate here. And these blights are really massive though. I'm gonna hit you. I'm still gonna be healing with the dog, I think. Okay, you're all, all of you are dead. That's cool. Yeah, I'm gonna de-stress here, and then I'm gonna go back with the positions. That's fine, it didn't hit. I, um, I was, you know, thinking that I shouldn't pick this up until I, um, switch the positions again, and then I uh, picked it up immediately. Good one, Jack, good one. This really pains me. I gotta do it. Switch these, switch their positions, back to the regular ones, switch the skills. I wonder how much of it is gonna be happening in the regular fights. I might actually drop the target whistle and just keep Cry Havoc and switch in the fights. Like, it could work, maybe. It's kind of risky, though. I wanna not take the target whistle. Uh, I already have two healers. I'm gonna take the target whistle. You're fine. All right, let's continue on. I, I purposefully let the blight on them. I was hoping for the vet to get to move on the vessel, but it didn't happen, unfortunately. Uh, again, take it on the way back. Also, need to keep in mind that I will have to have inventory space for the keys. This is actually a pickup, right? Of the torch. Oh, it's stress heal. Okay, who has stress? No one really. And just de-stress after I'm coming back. Okay, that's good to know. Okay. 
It's minus 30 stress, so I don't want to use it yet. Alright, this is an empty room. Followed up by a fight in the corridor, and then I think we're getting almost to the first key. Stress is piling up. There's the fight. Chevalier is gonna do a lot of deeps on us, unfortunately. I'm gonna direct heal the dog here. Even, like, he doesn't even have the curse and it's already taking, like, like, he has a low base HP. So, gotta, gotta keep it low, or rather, gotta keep the HP high. Low missing HP. So I guess what I wanted to say there. I actually prefer them using Gather the Blood. Oh boy, that's nice. Uh, aside from the dog, obviously, because I can get the curse, but it's obviously better than uh, pre digestion. I've actually never read that skill name properly before now. <laughs> Pre-digestion, what a skill name. Trying to eat me alive here. Alright, let's kill you. One health. I think I'm gonna let it rip on its own. And I'm gonna mark here. Actually, I'm, I'm, I'm making a lot of mistakes here. I really shouldn't be doing this. This is very greedy play. I really should be killing Supplicants first. If they can still curse me. And predigestion is annoying as hell. I guess nice and all to get rid of Chevalier because she does a lot of damage, but I'm gonna continue with this right now because she's already marked, so I do extra damage against it. And obviously I didn't use the proper skill there, which means I didn't do the extra damage. God damn it, Jack. 170, not worth it. They're not stunnable. Let's maybe get a kill. Nope. Yes. Yeah. Nice, also some stress heal. Alright, only one supplicant left. It's fine. The least worrisome target. Actually, I just noticed that Flagellant actually has less HP than the dog. Interesting. Alright, I don't think I need to hit here. Let's heal a little bit. The um, uh, bounty hunter is gonna finish him off. Actually, I'm gonna mark because of that, just so bounty hunter can 100% kill it. Yep. Kill him. There's the gems. Nice. Got Remind to stack some more stuff. Now, what is in this room? An insidious killer. Technically, I don't need this key, apparently, but I'll go for it. So I'm fairly certain this one opens up. Yeah, it opens up the gate number. It opens up the, this this gate over here. This key I'm going for, and not this room. The room after after this one north. Now I have to choose what is the way I'm gonna be dealing with the croc, and I think it's still the dog being the DPS. So let's go here. There's probably gonna be a fight. I need to remember that there's de-stressing available here. I also need to use the torch against the croc. Uh, that's annoying shuffle. But I think I'll live with it. Well, I don't have stunning this way. I mean, I do, but it doesn't really count. Maybe I should have marked. Because the, the courtesan also has to die. It's just gonna buff them all. Nice! Trionex, really nice. Unfortunately, you don't get the corpse, so I don't get to bleed both of them anymore. Are we? Also... Oh god, what an attack that is. What the fuck am I fighting here? That's fine. Curse is bound to happen anyways. 
He also gets the repost. What the fuck? What is that ability? That's so much bullshit in one ability. Please let me move. Thank you. Not the highest of heals. Now what do I kill here? I'm gonna go for this hit. Because this is gonna kill her with the bleed and I want the bounty hunter to hit this guy. Never mind. I was gonna go for it, but... Oh, no, never, no, 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 I will go for it anyways. The idea was that that would have been a big hit. And, but he still had the repose, so I was like, oh, come on, stop it. Okay, that's fairly bad. Okay, that's good. I get to fully heal or direct heal. I'm gonna go for it anyways. Now Doc can finish him off. Oh, come on! Seriously? It's a new one. With stress and bleed. Love it. These enemies are so bullshit. So, so, so bullshit. It's a nice hit though. Oh yes. That's very, very big. I was gonna heal with um, Flagellant, but now I don't think I want to do it. Despite having the bleed on. Okay. Really good dodge. Now I will get to heal even more, which is big because we're about to fight the mini boss. Oh, come on. I should outspeed it with the bounty under here, so I'm gonna go for a heal. Good crit too. Be wary. I mean, I probably should have removed. Yeah, I have twelve. Why didn't I remove that? I have twelve bandages. That was just a bad play, honestly. Now drop these. So I have to take the key anyway. So we're gonna be switching around because I want the dog to be DPS for that fight. There's no way I can take these anyways. I need the key. Alright, reposition. You're actually going into position 2 right now. We're not going any further this way. Now, this is the de-stressing one, right? Yeah. So I'm gonna de-stress uh, Bounty Hunter here. There's one more on the way back, which is nice. I'm gonna get to use that at some point. Alright, de-stress. Really good one. Okay. So this is the croc. There's no fight in the between. There's a shovel cu uh, curio though. Well, curio. It's an obstacle. Again, this is an optional key. You don't need to go for it. Annoying. Alright, do I have the skills? Kind of thinking about redeeming extent of, instead of exanguinate here, honestly. Seems to be the safer option. Aside from that, you don't need stunning. Well, I don't know if he moves me. I definitely want target whistle. Okay, fine. Alright, uh, let's go. Remember to use the torch jack. Remember. Just to get the accuracy. A hideous mutation. Unnatural and abhorrent. Three accuracy, not bad. I'm gonna heal. I know I'm basically at full health, but this guy's dodge is already high enough and I want to be as high as possible. That's gonna be a lot of stress on us, won't it? Especially with the curses. Come to Papa. Good. Start stacking the blades. Don't really have protection, but Mark would be really nice if I get to use the Bounty Hunter high damage here. Oh, I'm a stunner though. He has a debuff though, so I might as well go for it. Nice hit. I'm 
gonna go for hit here. I know my stress is very high already, but I think I have to. Really? What the fuck, dude? It's not like I do raptures or anything. That's the heal and the dodge, I think. Shit, that's a lot of damage he's got right now. And I don't get to stun him. This is stress again. Yeah, we should run, dude. We should run, right? Let's try getting a stun. Please move him forward, too. Fuck. Oh, come on. It's probably a bleed as well. That's bad. That's a good one, though. Oh, that's the submerge. I was the, he used the other skill some some time ago. I was thinking about the submerge. Then now I can't do anything from this position. I'm gonna try marking him. My chance to hit is forty percent. I might as well go for a heal instead. Again, forty percent. I'm gonna try it. Of course, it won't work. Move back into your position. Oh, go. What the fuck was the 36 hit? What the fuck was that attack about? What? No! What the hell? I was so bullshit. I was so glad they didn't hit the dog and... Oh my god. Oh my... Okay. That's not good. Injury and despondence set the stage for heroism or cowardice. That's really not good. Come on, don't you bleed? As life ebbs, Are you shitting me? Terrible vistas of emptiness reveal themselves. There's no way you can do this in one go anymore. We might just lose the Vestal here and have to run. Yep. We have to run. Fucking great. Fucking great. What is my luck against this fight? I don't believe he has that kind of a crit chance. I, I, I'm, I'm super unlucky in this one. The human mind. Fragile. Like a robin's egg. Can I even kill this thing anymore? Can't stun it. Teetering on the brink, facing That's my last redeem. The crit is big, but here comes the big attack again. I really need a Hyoman against this thing. Should have stunned there too. Okay, no crit at least. I have the bleed though. Which might be my undoing. I think we're gonna lose at least one more character in this fight. There it is. Bleed? No bleed. I can't he heal him though. That's the thing. I need to keep hitting. Oh my god, yes. Please let me hit. Please let me hit. Please let me hit. You moron. <sighs> Lovely, isn't it? As victories mount, so too will. Uh, we're out of this dungeon. We're going back. Uh... There's no enemies between me and the gate, so we're going back. Uh, you eat the food so you're not at the Death Star. 
Uh, I don't need these, I don't think. This was so bad. I, I didn't mean to click that actually, that was a misclick. I wonder just how unlucky I was in this fight. If this is really how it was supposed to go. What a weird item for a Vestal. That's gonna give me a trinket, right? If only treasure could well, the that flow. doesn't really constitute Other a trinket, I don't think. Uh, I mean, I don't need the shovel. No, there is a shovel cure. I don't need the torches. No, I don't need the torches. Uh, let's drop these. I mean, I might as well take everything that's gonna give me any resemblance of gold. All right. Time to go all the way back here. There's no fight in between us and that room. And it's time to come go home. Oh, we lost the fucking Vestal. That's so sad. That was a really powerful Vestal too. But this is also the second time I lose the first roll on the Death Star roll. So bullshit. So, so, so bullshit. We're gonna be so stressed out of this fight, not get basically any gold. Or your stress at least. Uh, I don't know. Basically, the map it's... Oh, no, no, take this, take this, take this. The map itself has 10 markers on it, one of which is very optional because either 8 or 9 leads to the boss, so we're, we've been taking either of those. Don't remember what the other ones were. I think one of them is a shovel one. Um... Okay, we're not, not even halfway done. Not even close to being halfway done. I would say it's one third done, if anything. I really didn't expect the croc fight to be this difficult. Well, okay, I, I, I will, I'm fully aware that we are on level fives and the fights are going to be way more difficult than they used to be, but the amount of crits, oh my, are you serious right now? What am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to take this fight now? Are you gonna eat? No. I think I have to take- I mean, I have the key to open the gate. What's gonna happen if I take this back? I don't know if I can take this fight. In all honesty. A fortune waiting to be spent. But I don't know if I can skip it either. Let's try running from it if anything goes there. Okay, it's <laughs> easy fight, quote unquote. We might get. Um... I really don't need them to dodge. I really don't. We might get a um, heart attack in this one. That would be cool. Oh yeah, we're the stunner this time. Because I didn't move the items around. Right. Mortality Are you serious? I really... That's the perfect target. But stop fucking critting me. What do I have? Like increased get crit chance? Get critted chance or something? to do 9 damage. I don't want to hit this one, I'd rather kill this one first. Executed. Please resist, please resist. I resisted the disease, so that's something resisted I guess. 
fuck off! No! That's fine, I guess. I need to hit this guy because dog just doesn't want to hit anything. Oh no, 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 please suggest, please. I need to mark it so the bounty hunter can actually do something. No, 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 no. Three howls in a row. The abyss returns even the boldest. That is heart attack, so I'm going to zero HP here. I get to heal though. And now the true test. As long as he doesn't, you know, decide to do some bullshit. Don't. Everything that can go against me in this dungeon is going against me. Literally everything is. None of these increased stress. I'm. Um, oh, it's night. Oh. Well, we're gonna get the affliction there. There's just no way around it. Uh, and there it is. Come on, virtue. Nope. Of course not. Why would I get the virtue? Why would I get lucky? Fury. More destructive than a hundred cannons. <sighs> I don't I don't know anymore if I can really do this dungeon. Even if I come back here, like losing another character this light into the game. Other, I mean, I have to do, deal with Fanatic otherwise. Which I don't know if it's... Uh, no, I, I can't deal with Fanatic. Fanatic kills, kills the... Kills the runs as well. Okay, what is this curio here? Well, I can lower the stress a at least, I guess. Maybe I don't get the uh, another heart attack. Oh, we get to open the door at least, so there's that. And uh, it's time to go home. There's absolutely no way we can continue. Oh well, that was way more difficult than I was hoping for it to be. Go home. Do not ruminate on this and this progresses area. the week count as well and we lose an invitation. And got 10k back and we didn't spend basically anything aside from the provisions for the mission but lost the character the dominia is bad that's the only bad really obviously a lot of stress treatment to be happening my obsession that was really terrible fondness, and it is shameful that i must rely upon you to set it right that was really terrible. I'm five deaths away from losing the run. Six, actually. Yeah, at six deaths, the run is over. That's a third level six character that we've lost. Oh well. We're gonna try this some other time. So, thank you everyone for watching. And see you next time. Bye bye.